Good morning, afternoon, evening, or whatever time of day you are watching this video. My name, as always, is Mr. D. And today, I'm super excited to read this book to you guys, because this one is about an emotion that we all feel sometimes. And it's the hardest one to keep under wraps and to keep control. So I'm really excited to bring you this book today. And this book is called the Angry Ninja, da 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 da, ba 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 ba, Angry Ninja. Boom. So come along, let's read this book, and let's find out what we can do to bring our anger down and to control that anger so it doesn't get the best of us. Perfect. Angry Ninja. My sister had used my jump rope without asking. And it made me furious. Furious is like a really angry thing. And he says, give it back. Look at him yelling at her and look at her. She's so sad because of it. She's so sad because of it. I could feel my throat tighten. My heart beating faster. And my breathing getting heavy. I felt as if I was going to scream any second. Oh, look at his face. Look at that. You can feel the anger coming up in you when it's happening. And then it happened. I exploded. <laughs> look at him. He exploded. And what does it look like when we explode? It could look like hitting could look like pushing, could look like yelling or screaming or swearing, and it could look like throwing things around. That's what it looks like when you explode, when you don't control and manage that anger in a healthy way. It wasn't fun being upset and having everyone mad at you, but I just didn't know how to control my emotions. And that's something that I, luckily I, my mission in life is to teach you guys who are watching this video how to do. It's excellent. It's wonderful. Look at him. He doesn't know. He's not sure what to do to make it better or to control it from getting any worse. Later that day, positive ninja. Positive means good things. Ninja came out to hang out with me. We decided to play a game of pig. Everything was going fine until I got upset when I was losing. Look at that. I know that I get upset sometimes when I'm losing a game. Especially a game where I know I'm really good at. If it's a game that I know I'm not good at or anything, then I go like, ah, ha, 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 it's all fun and games. But if it's a game that I'm really good at and I'm losing at it, then that gets me frustrated. That gets me upset. And guess what happened? I don't know what happened. We talked about it. Positive Ninja explained, anger is normal. It's how you deal with it that makes a difference. There's something I do, and it's super easy. Do you want me to show you what it is? And he says, sure. What could it be? I use the 1 plus 3 plus 10. One, calm word, like relax. You could say breathe. You could say chill. You could say cool. Some calm words. You say it out loud because saying words has power to it. Then I take three deep breaths and remember. And remember, you always breathe in through your nose. Out through your mouth. Three deep breaths like that. And then you count to ten slowly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then you say an I am statement, an I statement. I am angry because I'm losing this game. And when you say how you're feeling, 
it lets other people know and it lets them understand how they can work with you better how they can interact with you, how they can be around you that can help you feel better too. I'm mad that you broke my toy. And he says, thanks for telling me how you feel. And from there you can go and make it better. Afterwards, I went inside to get some chocolate cake my mom had made. When I found out my sister ate the last slice, I started to clench my fist, which means he can tell by the fact that he's clenching his fist that he's starting to get a little bit angry. But then I remembered what Positive Ninja said. And do you know what happened? Let's find out what happened. I'm going to tell you what happened. I said to myself, oh wait here, sorry, we're going to show you the picture. Show you the picture of him being angry. Look at that. He's angry. But then you remember what Positive Ninja said. And Positive said, to say to yourself, breathe. And then you breathe in. And out. And in. And out. And in. And out. And then you count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And you say how you're feeling. And he says, I'm upset that there's no more chocolate cake. Look at that. He's using his words and talking about how he feels. And because what happens then is if you can use your words and say, I am angry that there's no more chocolate cake left. Then instead of throwing stuff around, yelling at his sister, doing all those things that he shouldn't do when he's angry, something nice could happen. He could go to his mom and say, I'm angry that there's no more cake left. I can't believe that my sister ate it all. She could be like, oh, well, that's okay. I have um, like another chocolate bar you can have instead. Or it's okay, we're going to make you another cake or something like that. There can be a solution that comes from that. People can help you when you talk about your feelings, when you talk about your emotions. It worked. It felt strangely good. A simple secret strategy to stay calm could become your secret weapon for managing anger. And look at him all happy now. So, I want you all to remember that we are going to say our calming word, whatever word you decide it to be. We're going to say chill or cool or breathe. And then we're going to do it together. Okay, ready? We're going to say breathe. And then we're going to do this strategy, okay? Everybody together? Get ready. Ready? We can start that. One, two, three. Breathe. And we're going to breathe in through our nose. And out through our mouth. In through our nose. And out through our mouth. And one more time in through your nose. And out through your mouth. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then I'm going to say, I am angry because all of the announcements keep interrupting my video. And you know what? Saying it out loud. I realized that, you know, it's not that bad. It's not a big deal because that sometimes happens in life. So we just got to kind of roll with it. So thank you, everybody, for watching this video with me. I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope that you learned something today on how to control that anger inside of you. So have a great day, everybody. Mr. D saying, see you all next time. Bye.